This design was originally created by Dan Lee Tini or Dan Lee Tiny. Actually, is on Instagram. You can check him out. This is the original design. So we want to create, recreate it. All right. I have all the necessary tools. So let's get to work. So I'm just going to write shield and trade here. Shield and trade. Okay. Okay, so the font that was used here is a vertical. Now, as a designer, the more you use or play with your font the more it gets used to you so that by just looking at a person's design you'll be able to identify the font that was used okay so i already know that this is the font that was used a vertical you can see it now all right so i just click here click and then select this color Now, I'm going to take everything out like this so that I select the color that I want to use. Right here, I'm seeing two colors. So I'm going to go to gradient. I'm going to select this so that I can choose the two colors. The first one I'm seeing here is this blue right here. Um, it's a blue. That's not the blue, so let's get the original design so that we can pick the colors. So I'm picking this design right here so that I can pick the color from the design directly. So I'm going to go over here, click, and then I'll pick from the design. So I can pick it from here, okay? Cool. Then the middle one here, we have something like this. Okay, so let me pick. Okay, that is it. Something like that. Alright, so I'm putting it here. I will increase it. First, put it here. Still reduce it here. Alright. So I have something like that there, okay? Alright, let me just scroll down and pick this color directly from here. Go shot. I think this is better. Alright, um, let me still move this to the down. Alright, centralize this. Um, bring this text. Alright, it's just like this, like this, reduce it and put it right there from there it's gonna stretch out to here so you just centralize this put it at the middle all right okay okay so after you've done that you want to get the logo okay so the logo is going to be this right here to be x I'm just gonna come come here and I'll click on this. Alright, I'm using it because I didn't get the original logo, so I'm just gonna use this. Um so I can't use this, I will take it out and bring in this particular logo. This guy. Alright, so just go and change the color to white. reduce it it's going to be at the base there so let's just let's, let's give a rule here nine nine um okay what was used here was 12 so let's go and use 12 all right so if that's the case that means this guy is going to be here i mean this logo 
is going to be here. Alright, and we can still reduce it. Right, so I adjust it here. Okay, so we have this other one that's going to be here. Okay. We just put it right there. Alright. So I'm gonna I'm gonna pick a font for it. I'm still going to use a vertical. So let me use this. Um no 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 okay. Okay, so the next thing we want to do is to get this particular image. So let's bring this image to the front. Let's remove this guy. So we have something like this, right? So we can bring in this guy now. This guy. A shape. So the shape should be like a screenshot like this. Alright, then you move over here, click on texture and add the screenshot so this is the first one we're gonna be adding okay uh, i'm still gonna stretch it like this and i would still stretch it okay stretch it okay small okay it has entered perfectly so i can bring it here i'll bring it here right still reduce it bring it there all right centralize it then bring this guy to the front always all right now we can leave that we can leave that then you can come over here copy put this one here this time around change what will be inside so we we'll put let's say this Okay, I think this is going to be for this side. So, so to adjust this, you just come over to perspective. So I'm going to put it here and adjust it here. So come over to perspective. I will reduce it first, and then I'll click on perspective, enable it, and try to do this adjustment here. So it's going to be like this. It's going to be like this. Okay. It's gonna be like this it's gonna be like this stretch this out and and this okay so I've done this I'll put it here I'll click on it again and drag it up so something like that right Alright, we have something like this, right? So we'll come over here and add a shadow to it. The shadow is gonna be this, and we'll stretch it to this part of it. Alright, then we'll come over here and add inner shadow to it. No, not this one. I think this is okay. Okay, so copy this, not this, copy this. And put it here bring the other guy um this guy all right then we'll do this all right we'll do this um we'll go over here also and click on perspective and try to adjust it the other way all right okay all right so something like this now so just reduce this and put it there um bring this here put it here 
all right so i have something like this right uh let me adjust this okay i have something like this but this time around you bring this shadow to this other side here all right something like that right then you can bring this guy to the front okay then you come here and you bring this guy to the front yeah at the base all right a code that can be scanned then you come over here and you do something like this like a button like a button a yellow button yes and then you adjust it here okay adjust it here I think the word there is um, let's see let's trade okay so i'm going to remove this guy it said it says let's trade so just bring this guy copy it and reduce it put it there so it said let's trade don't forget to like this video and share it let's trade share it with a friend change the color to black all right and put it there at the middle let's trade all right so let me adjust it all right so we have something like this i think the only problem now is this phone that i use here so i'm going to take it back mm, let's use this guy uh, come over here and use this right so something like that right so i can move this down a little all right so this is what we have if you if you are done like this you can go ahead and save your design and do some editing but this is cool all right you can go ahead and save click on this part here and save your design my name is niamuda and i will see you in the next tutorial have a blast